This is your basic bow staff tutorial. Mine's a little bit taller than my head. Yours can be taller, shorter, it doesn't matter. Don't think about it too much. Just grab your staff and let's get started. Before we get started, remember to hit like and subscribe. Share this video with others who are also training. And in the comment sections below, tell me what your staff is made of. This one's made out of rattan, it's very light. What are you using? Start with your hands in the middle of your staff and start to spin in one direction. It's not gonna matter which way. Point your pinky finger up. Notice that your other pinky finger is pointed up. Start at your elbow and slide down. Catch it, let the other one go. It twists until the hands are in line again. And then you let it go, twist again. Bring it over. Just make a very simple, easy, basic motion. You're gonna warm up your wrists this way, warm up your hands, your shoulders, and mostly you're just gonna teach your body how to move the staff through space. Stop it this way, and now you're gonna go the other way until the pinky comes up, the hand comes over the top, again, pinky side up, turn it, catch it, and turn it. You're just coming over that elbow, sliding down, catching in the middle. Now the other spin that I want you to learn is over the back of the wrist. And then the palm comes up. The hand then becomes perpendicular coming out of the ground. You're holding just with the thumb and your other hand is gonna push over the back of the wrist. The hand opens. You're just assisting it with the other hand, helping it get over the back of the wrist. Then I want you to try it unassisted. All about momentum. There's a speed that it has to move at. Any slower, it's gonna to fall to the floor. Too fast, there's no such thing as too fast. And stop it again. Again, the hand perpendicular coming out of the floor. The other hand assisting as it goes to the back of the other wrist. After a while, go unassisted. Now, in the right hand, with your right foot forward, and I say right hand, it doesn't matter, you can do right or left first. But whichever hand is in front, put that foot in front. That makes your body smaller. So as we spin, we're gonna go now into figure eight spin to the front and the back of the body. This is the front of the body, and then it comes to the back of the body. Forward rotation. Your thumb is leading. Very simple move. Now put it in the other hand just grab it, and go the other way. And now you're gonna pull and reverse the spin. Before I was going down with the thumb, now I'm pulling up just in the opposite okay. direction and start to pull. And the other hand, same kind of switch, just grab it, don't get fancy yet. Now I want you to learn two things that look really cool, but are very basic and simple. One is the transfer behind your back, and then you bring it out. Start with the staff in the right hand, come behind your back, and I want you to see what this looks like. Thumb is up, and grab under, and then pull it out. Bring your hand under. Pull it out. So you start with the staff in front of your body, bring it behind you, pull it out to the other side. Just go back and forth a couple times. And the second one is spinning over your head. And I'm gonna kneel down and show you what this looks like. It's the one you warmed up with. It's the same spin, but it's just over your head. Go the other way. 
And now you put those two together and you'll look really cool. You start here, go behind your back, over your head, and keep moving behind your back. And then you're gonna go the other way. Now finally, I want you to do some strikes with me. Start with the hands here, kind of like you're doing a push-up. This is also correct, but it's a different kind of strike. The strike you're doing with me, the hands will be this way. Make sure you have a good, firm grip. Start with one foot in the front. I have my left foot, and I'm gonna to strike to the left. And then I'm gonna strike to the middle. And I'm gonna strike to the knee. Now I step with my right, I'm gonna go to the temple, to the ribs, to the knee. Step with the left, up, middle, down. Make sure you're bringing it over that elbow. Step with the right, strike up, strike the middle, strike, always strike with force. Step with the left, one, two, three. Step with the right, up, middle, down. All right, here's a really quick bonus for you. I want you to start the same way we did at the beginning. We were doing that assisted to an unassisted wrist roll. You're gonna do that unassisted wrist roll one way, and then you're gonna bring it back the other way. I want you to get used to how the staff moves, and you're gonna work on, this helps with your timing, this helps you with your hand strength, your wrist strength. This is also gonna build your confidence as you get used to the staff so that you don't drop it as much. This very beginning stage, if you're a very beginner, you're gonna drop it a lot. And that happens to me even now. If I pick up a weapon I haven't messed with in a while, you ask me to show you how to use it, or it's a new one, I haven't even messed with it before, I drop it a lot. And that's really the only difference between somebody, you, who's gonna learn it really well, and somebody, whoever else, doesn't, is that they just quit. Not the dropping it. You're gonna drop it as much or more than anybody else, just like I do. Just keep picking it up. You just keep picking it up, keep picking it up, and just do it. Just get it done.